What's up guys, Mike from Rockville, and today we're looking at the DMX-CT and the DMX-QR. Now what this is, is wireless DMX technology that allows you to connect a DMX controller to a light or a group of lights. Now the way it works is you have a transmitter, that's the DMX-CT. This connects to your DMX controller, and then you take one of the transmitters and put it on your light, and it'll create a wireless 2.4 gigahertz signal. Now it connects with GFSK modulation on a 126 channel high speed frequency hopping technology that basically means there's not gonna be any interference even when you go to the end of the range which is 1.25 miles which is 400% greater than similar DMX transmitters and receivers. So most wireless DMX transmitters and receivers only support up to seven light groups but unlike that these ones support up to 16 groups. It's super easy to sync unlike the usual ones where you have to sync them up by lights this one has a button with numbers and letters so you go to channel one you sync it up with channel one and there's 16 different channels that you can select but you can always start really simple and just daisy chain a bunch of light just using one dmx transmitter and one dmx receiver so let me show you how to integrate this into your setup right now so the first thing you're going to want to do is take your transmitter this is the DMX-CT. You're gonna to wanna to plug it into the power supply that comes included in the box. Once it turns on, you wanna set it to a channel. So I'm gonna set it, right now it's on channel one, I'm just gonna set it to channel two really quick. So channel two. Then I'm gonna plug that into my DMX controller. Now I'm gonna take my DMX receiver. So you're gonna plug it into the included power supply. Now it automatically goes to channel one. I just click channel two. That's all it takes to sync it up. So channel two on here, channel two on the transmitter. I go ahead and plug it in through standard DMX in onto my light. On the Rock Par 50, I have this addressed to DMX channel one. So if I raise fader one, it should bring up the reds. You can see it does that. I bring up two, it brings up the greens. I do three, it brings up the blues, and then I can go all in. Now the really cool thing is this transmitter also works with lights that have wireless DMX built into them. So I have the best par 60 here. If I turn it around, you can see there's a wireless DMX signal button on the back. If I change it to channel two, which is the green channel, you'll see it's synced up with channel two on the transmitter now, which is flashing. And if I go to fader one on my rock force, it should bring up the reds. You can see it does that. Go to channel two, it's the greens. Channel three, it's the blue. So just like that, you can see how super easy it is to use the DMX CT and the DMX QR. So obviously this is super useful if you're into stage lighting or up lighting and wall washing. If you're a DJ and you have a bunch of DJ lights that you want to set up against your venue, or even if you have a small club or a music venue where you want to be able to control all the lights in different rooms with one controller. So if you're looking for a super easy to set up long range wireless DMX transmitter and receiver that gives you control over 16 different groups of lights. Look no further than the DMX-QR and the DMX-CT. If you liked what you saw in this video, leave a like and a comment in the comment section below. As always guys, I'm Mike from Rockville. I'll see you next time.